I just go to my local thrift store and I buy some old books and I select them by size. So I added the texture medium using a Jamie Ray vintage stencil. I use the damask stencil. And then there's a little bit on the spine of this too. So the one that I used on the front of that book is this damask stencil. So um, I love it because it allows me so many options. So if I only want to use a portion of it, like I did on the book, I'll just tape it off. But that gives a lot of interest to the top of the book. So. This texture medium is super smooth. I'm gonna hold it in place and then I just smooth it through my transfer. And I did the ones that we're actually gonna paint on today when I got in today, so probably just a little after 12 is when I did them. And I'm just going the thickness of the stencil. So then you just pull this straight up and, and you get that beautiful pattern. So this is going to be raised and I'm just going to go over the whole thing. Jamie Ray Vintage Farmhouse Stencil. So I'm gonna um, stencil. I'm gonna put our story here and I'm gonna put love on the front. So So that says our story. Okay. So I'm just going to literally drag it across the top. I'm going to go ahead and put my flowers on. I'm going to add the gold to the bottom book. So that's just getting it to tie together now. So when you see them finished, the um, spines are gonna be cohesive. And I am going to use the same brush and I'm gonna hit the tips of my roses. So this is where we're at so far. So I'm just going to use an artist brush because that's what I have handy. And Big Top Sealer. 